Well, hello, hello. This is Comrade Sirius, and I got some news for you. One of first is them that this incinerator now uh, has. Well, it has water because it has been delivered there. This one is still not have ready, but it has power. So we absolutely can start doing some things with it. So let's assign some. Maybe a small van would be enough for the line, but we do not have uh, we do not have do not have small vans now. But we have some road depots, so well, we might as well utilize them. If we take at buses and you know total capacity and probably not workshop, we can have seven seven. We can have eight passengers, and we will use many many of these. So one two three. I will just pick three, and one of them will get directly assigned to the city, to load workers, 100%, yeah, that's perfectly alright, no students, no passengers, and definitely not tourists, and we do not need workers with high, edu high, edu high education, and they will be going here, and here they will be unloaded. And once they will be unloaded, the bus will go through this end station. That's about it. A few things I noticed in the meantime. This should be filled with fuel and it's not. So well, let's assign. Let's assign to fuel to be delivered here so buses can refuel while on the line. That's the sole purpose of having them. And then a few more things. We wanted to use this bus stop as a secondary for, you know, for the heating plant because we will definitely do not need 15 workers at this incinerator. Now I will leave it, but we do not need it. And workers can go through here to this to this heating plant. The problem is there's no way of getting them, you know, Getting them there via only dirt. There is footpaths, and in the future, I want this to be connected to some separ general separation and stuff like that. So I will keep I will keep that in mind. I will definitely put a, or maybe at, at least try to put a road through here. Yeah, that happened. Uh, and there won't there won't be any unloading station for this stuff. So the road will be will now be going around around this, and you can see there there are some road connections definitely needed in this area. So right now they will be they will be like this, connected like this. I have no idea how this area will will be lo will be looking in the future. So I'll just I'll just have it like this now. Well, well, not like this. So just make it nicer. But we de we definitely need to do something with with this road, and we can demolish it afterwards. There's there's nothing saying that we cannot. So I will definitely need to turn this into gravel path because the mud path would definitely not be enough. I already tried and saw that it's not working. We will use last of these gravel store and I will pay DO dumpers to stop stop supplying these these two storages because we will want to use our storage or at least our gravel plant. Th that brings me to another topic to another part we do not we basically do not need this distribution office we need one of those trucks well you're the chosen one and we need it to just come here load coal wait until loaded and to go to the storage and wait until unloaded in any foreseeable future we do not need any other vehicle to do this job And 
I think it I think one of these huge trucks will be enough to do this job. This also means that we probably do not need this you know gas station. I will move it for now. I'm still not ready to build a permanent one here because I have no idea how this area will look like in the future. So I'll just make it make it like this and this is number three so yeah it's not unload it is slowed till there's basically you know anything left and we have a gas station here so wow what well, we do not need this to be sub this one supplied and Yes, I will demolish this one because we do not need it. What we will need is to supply this area, and I will and I will demolish this distribution office and the road leading to it. Yeah, I definitely did something about with the tracks about the tracks. Well, that's to be me, I suppose. This one can also look better. But we will need to do something with this mixed waste. Because as you can see there's ash. There's some aluminum scrap and there's some metal scrap. That is the only thing that you know goes from the mix. Because everything else will be redu reduced to ashes. Literally. But we need something to do about something to do about these things. And as you can see we have some workers here and we will need workers in the heating plant as well so let's kick start it before winter comes because it's it's definitely not not too far away and we have the heat exchange done in the meantime that's great i haven't noticed it but well that's great i do not need to select to you know load and unload anything I just need to specify there are no tourist thingies in the area so well let's go you can drive where is the other one control left click that's the second and you will go to the to the end station first there will be two two trucks driving as you can see there are a lot of there are definitely a lot of workplaces or possible workplaces to go so I definitely want like 60% of them to go to the heating plant and the rest now just to the gravel processing. And these two storages I will just say to notify if empty, well both of them. And once they are done they will be empty and they will be demolished and we will switch to our own production. What I can and will do is to make this line a little bit a little bit more productive you can say well by the way where where is the bus what are these two small incinerator water subsidy yeah they, they are buses of builders well we will need that's one thing that we will definitely need we will need to build some dumps to store the ashes because there will come a lot of ashes and we have no way of processing this thing right now. We have no general separation and the more important thing, we will not have it right now. If we take, um, if we look at dumps, we have small for 80 tons, it's not much, but it costs basically nothing, just some gravel and concrete. We have medium dump that costs some, a little bit of steel, some asphalt and the problem for us currently is prefab panels, that's something we definitely do not have. And then there are three dumps for 140 tons, but we can have only five of them and we have already three. Yeah, we have we have this one that we can definitely, you know, demolish and move elsewhere. But this one has some metal scraps inside from the demolition and this one has some construction waste, which is definitely not great to begin with. And this one, as you can see, it's, it's filling really fast. 
definitely something I do not like. So we need to do something about it. And yes, as a, as as, it, as it's looking, we can send people both to incinerator and to heating plant. Well, we can do 50-50 because this one is important for us. But we need we will need to place some dumps. We can have also dumps with claw machines, but they cost really really a lot of steel. And the claw machine is good for loading. Nothing new. And there are mechanical components there are you know they are expensive. If we would if we would need to build some of those, I would probably go with these claw machines, the large ones. Because the reason the change of in cost is definitely not much. But I do want the cheapest option possible. Alright. Now so we will what we what we are going to do is to build a range of of these small dumps we definitely do we definitely do not need ton of them we definitely do not need some fancy solution right now we what we only need is to have some space to store what will be produced in this incinerator so i'll try this thing i never tried it this way but it might be useful in the future let's go with this i have no idea where we will be, be building next and what we will do afterwards but i kind of feel that we will use this road in the future so let's build it before we start and yeah i might yeah i might place the dump back the free one just so we can expand on our on our trash business so these will be for mixed waste and for mixed waste and i will do, do something with distribution offices what do we have we have two two of those three so I will, I will pick this one. They need some vehicles. I understand it. Maybe this one would be great. I can reassign it right away because why not? So I have a waste truck there, and I and I will tell it, go here, and fill it. Well, right now, ninety percent is all right. And you will load hazardous waste here at customs. Once it's done, you can go here to incinerator out, load mixed waste and deliver it here. And you can fill it from 100% obviously. And I will add you two more dump trucks. These two, yes. And I will need to set the incinerator out not to zero percent but maybe to 60 because ash can still disperse from here and i hope it will be we will be enough we uh, that we will process enough waste the question is do we have heat here we have heat uh, there's a uh, there's a lot of workers right <laughs> i don't think we need them now but we will we'll, we will need them later but that brings me to an idea of yeah we have due to no workplace people okay i will try to survive on one more one more of these buses yep small incinerator add to the line yeah you can definitely start it right now because we need more money let's start with that thing and we have a lot of money because well we probably do not have we do not we are we are not building anything right now so i can send people i can send people here i'm not sure i can send them here though 
I will do only this because I know I can afford it and they are already supplied. Yeah, this one cannot export water, that was kind of expected. Well, time to set these so they load only bricks, prefabs, boards. And I'll say no steel for now, because we need to get, we need to be holding some amount right now. Because this is kind of scary, 40,000 is not great. This one is not hooked. Oh fuck. So this one is not, this one is not hooked as well. Well, we're in a pickle. That was definitely not expected to happen. Okay, this one is a large priority right now. I may lose some people. And that's because I'm an idiot. There's definitely no other reason than this one. We do have some time before snow will, snow will be falling, but these guys will not be happy. And I have no place of putting them. Besides this one, so... Well, yeah. Not great. Because there's no way I'm building, the, I'm able to finish this, this this pipe and, you know, the other pipe and the pump. Building is on fire, heating, yeah. Who are you going to? Yeah, they are going for asphalt. Yeah. Yes. We will need to set up our own production of these of, of these things probably sooner than later. Yeah. I will assign them but the house is absolutely top priority right now. We will need paths to do this work for us, so three workers and four workers. There's basically no other way of doing this. One, two. And that's it. That's what we can do right now. We are al almost halfway through the first first tech, and I think I can add more because we do not have we do not have more students right now. So maybe even five is alright. So it runs faster. If we look we have 65 high education workers, that means we gain 5, 5 of our own, that's great. Because we bought like 60, now we have 65, 17% is still not great and we will need to do something about it later on. But well, it's better than nothing. And we will need to we will need to do something about these these guys. Maybe add a few more so we have the Soviet emblem ready. This one we cannot build. And we cannot build them because we do not have concrete and other stuff. But I can at least add this. Yeah, excavator is working and we should definitely have things for this one as well. Oh, this one is definitely not empty yet. Yeah, we need to free our customs because this is this has no future. And as I'm looking at it, we have our own gravel. We have definitely produced some gravel. So, well, let's do the thing we are supposed to do. 1961 gravel. First goal is already met. And I almost feel like for the time being that I can start export it. I have no idea if it's a good or bad idea, to be honest. Well, 
we have more more pushing matters now. Why? Well, just I'll add this column to be built. And I think that when we have our own gravel orb that we will what we will have soon. I can definitely start graveling this thing up. Well, this obviously didn't help. Can I just do this with machinery only? Yes, I can. So, let's do it. And I definitely can do this one as well. They will take some time, but we have a lot. We have a lot of hazardous material here, and as you can see, mixed waste is piling up. Now ah, this one will take its toll. Temperature too low. We have 536 people. Let. I'm really curious of how it will end up in at the end of the episode. We are around 40,000. So, so. We can take a look at the last month or maybe this month. Yeah, but now it's last month because it's November. Yeah, we exported negative numbers and we imported well, we made some money <laughs> on the imports. We have definitely, we didn't def definitely did not spend enough, or not processed enough of the waste. So I guess we'll keep it this way right now. Can you load this? Yeah, you can. We have a lot of gravel sitting sitting around here. That's crazy. And I definitely feel like we should be we should prepare another construction office. 16 It's not that big of a difference to be honest. And we will not build anything at this area any, anyway. So I'm really tempted and yeah, I will go for it. I will go for it. A fort, so no snapping. Oh, we cannot make it this way. We can grab this up because this will be construction office HCO24 and it will be it will be gravel. I know what, I, what it will be. It will be this basically this whole area, you know, gravel loading, concrete, all this related stuff. What did you buy? Tons of things. I really hate it. And we're not buying steel, right? Well, notify me if empty. I'll just click on it. To be fair, I'm not really comfortable with what's happening right now. Oh, this one can be built only with machinery. That's cute. I didn't notice at first, but now it's making perfect sense. How is it looking? They can be laying bricks right now. Okay. 
40 people just build this. Citizen Zeppelin is too low. Yeah, it's these ones. Yeah. Just go build it, guys. You have a crane, you can just, you know, send it here. Too late. The crane has just went there, so, well, no. Get it back. We, need, we do not need to waste fuel on this. Ah, maybe 40 is too much because we will not deliver all these components in time. But we have steel now, so it's... This one is waiting for bricks to be laid down. That's also great. I will not as I will assign. Just kidding. I will assign this to we you know mixed waste again. Can I do something with this part so it's not no definitely a mud path. Yes, I can do something about this. And this is only a gas station, which we definitely do not need right now, so gravel this bit completely. And this bit as well. Yeah, the heating problem is definitely a problem. No one no one please move here. These guys who will disappear sooner or later. We already lost like three of them, it seems. Yep, yeah, I definitely screwed up. And I do not want people to go anywhere else beside this this area. Missing resource gravel, that's great. All related vehicles, where are you from? This construction office. Well, that's a good news. So you will pick gravel from from here. Gravel one can be demolished. We have a lot of snow plows and just and other trucks just lying around. That's crazy. Should probably do something about it. Probably do something about it quick quickly twenty seven tons of steel and a half of mechanical components. Ouch, that will hurt. I'll just set this to notify me when finished because I'm I'm really angry at myself. Yeah, and now we are waiting for set of boards and con and steel. Do we have steel? I hope so. Yeah, we do. Boards are coming. Steel should be coming soon. These are boards. Don't go for break bricks here. Yeah. Go for yeah. Go for steel. That's the only thing that matters right now. Yeah, we lost a lot of people. Not anyone university educated, but these guys are definitely not happy. Yeah, steel is there. Boards are there right away. 
So now we need them. Now we need them to finish it. And it's snowing. Come on. Eleven. I I have no idea how these guys are still alive. But it's finally finished, so relocate up to up to everyone into another building. 7% happiness, I know. Yeah, health too low, happiness too low, but construction has finished. So these guys should recover sooner or, or later, hopefully, because yeah, they have heat. They, this house will be heated. And we have, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> one just left. <laughs> After he's been moved from this uh, freeze, frozen hell hole, <laughs> he just left. He's had enough. And another one. Yeah, and another one. We will lose a bunch of them. And now, currently we are on 940 points spent. So I'll just add a bunch of people to sp just, you know, make this thing better for these people. Like, one, two, three, four. So, so now we are at 980 points. And we can allow them to, you know, start working on the other <laughs> building in a row. Well, hope it was fun for you, at least today. We have, we, I really wasn't expecting this. That was totally my oversight. But hey, shit happens and we need to be prepared for it. So, have a nice day guys. Leave a like or a comment if you like this type of videos or whatever. And... Hopefully, see you soon. Bye-bye.